What's up YouTube, this is Razzle of Ryan here today bringing a brand new series on FIFA 17 Ultimate Team. So this series is going to be a road to glory and if you guys don't know what that is, where I don't spend any money on the account, I try and get as high as I can in divisions and try and get the best team as I can, so you can get some like Ronaldo's, get lucky in the packs and stuff like that. So in this series I'm trying to show you the most efficient way to deal with your coins, how to make coins, what's the best to do. Like My opinion, it's all my opinion, so... Is what I think is best. So just if you watch other Road to Glory, then I might do different to other people. But this is a starter pack that we got. Uh, we got two seventy five rates, is pretty good. The controls not working. Oh, that's why. So play views. So um, at first, I'm gonna play probably a few games on single player tournament and try and win to get as many coins through that. Also, with the manager tasks, which you need to do, advance through that. So, the manager tasks are. Why is it laggy? So, we are back on Ultimate Team and we're going to go to the single player and then squad building challenges. I know that I'm a bit late to do this. I just didn't know what series that I wanted to do. Just, you know, go through all the FIFA 17. Like, I didn't know if to do this series or just create a different one i wasn't exactly sure what i wanted to create like i didn't know what to do career mode or anything like that but i decided to do this i think i'll enjoy this the most and help you guys the most so just let's get started we'll do this right now what do we get from it should we get some coins well oh, it's been a freeze for some reason blah blah, blah. we know how to do this advance go back so we get two players pack. Is it? A, I think it's a lone two players pack though. Oh no, it's just two players pack. Right, okay. So go and sit the first exchange. We'll do this right now. Start from scratch. If it takes me too long, I'll cut it out and show you what I've done. But the first one shouldn't take too long at all. So goalkeeper. Da, da, da. Actually, let's go and look at our team first to make sure that we don't want to go into a certain team and get rid of the player that we wanted to get rid of. So this is what my pack got me. So an English player, an English goalkeeper. Who else we got? We've got another English striker. Argentina, 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 Argentina. We've got quite a few Argentinians. German, blah, blah, blah. Not many Germans. So I'm going to get rid of that German goalkeeper on the squad building challenges. If you guys want any tips or ask any questions, put them down in the comments. I try. I will reply, but I don't know if I'll know the answer to them. But I'll try my best. So let's search in. Let's hear that German guy. Boom, boom. Submit that. Submit squad. We've got a bronze pack there. Yeah, um, one bronze gift pack. It's been laggy once again. Right, the second step. Start from scratch. So what's this? And team chemistry minimum 12 and number of players in the squad 3. Can we get any players in centre mid? Do I have to have them linked up? Let's see the Argentinian guy. I don't really want to build into Argentinian league, it's not that good. Yeah, we should be able to put anyone in. Put the lowest rated guy, why not? Boom, boom. That should be done. Yep, there we go. Submit that squad. So there's another one bronze pack, which is good for us. I might go and open them right now. So I know the last one's a bit hard to. It's, not, it's only a hard to if you don't have the players to do it. So these packs help us get the players. So all these episodes will most probably be live. Um, I'll cut in and cut out the best and worst parts. So you guys can watch just the best parts of um, each episode. And it's more uh, relatable to you guys. Right, okay. Is that MLS guy? No, it's not. Sweden. Let me check this guy because. Oh, it's untradeable. It's currently a Swedish. We'll show them to the club, by the way, guys. It's currently a Swedish um, squad building challenge out at the moment. So I think I think there's in the way. Well, the Swedish league, anyway. Another Argentinian guy, okay. So there's only four players in this pack, I think. Oh, four cards, four cards. Healing. Can you 
sell these? No, we can't sell these. So once again, sell it, put these to the club for me as well. No point discarding them. We use them for any uh, squad building challenges. Or if we need to put any cards on our players, we use that. So we got back to single player squad building challenges. So I'm aiming at first, guys, is to play a few games in single player, win what, one or two divisions, and then get enough coins to make a decent team, then go online. I don't go online straight away. There's no point. I'll just get battered. And also, I'm not the best FIFA player, so don't get annoyed if I lose a few games. But I'm okay. But I'm definitely not the best. So I don't know if I'll be able to do this. Left mid. Let's put him in. So you need 17 Cam. Cam, we'll put you in. National is exactly three. Oh, okay. So yeah, we're not going to see this right now. We haven't got the players to do it. So let's send these to the club. We'll have to come back and do that a different time. Send to club. There we go. Right, we'll come back and do that a different time. Yeah, they got Ibrahimovic one. They've got a Swedish one somewhere. That one. A Swedish league, I think. Right, so what can we do now? Online, no, nothing to do with that. Squads, we know my squad. Store, can't get anything there. Transfers, can't buy anyone. Got no coins. Oh my god. Club, we know a club. So we go to the catalogue, go to ultimate team, okay, and we'll buy some of these, we'll buy this one, have we got this one? As you guys see, I'm on level 5, so most of you guys will be level 5, so whatever I do in this account, you guys should be able to do, no matter what, because I've started at the very bottom, we're near enough at the bottom, and we no coins, no nothing, but you guys should be in front of me, because you've had the game for a while, or well, if you get it at Christmas, then you can follow what I'm doing right now. Level 5, who's he? Adonai. 3,300. I should buy some, shouldn't I? Let's buy him. Redeem item. And let's buy him. Redeem item. Let's buy this guy as well. Just because we haven't got any players at the moment. Well, any good players, so I might as well put them in team. Claim new items. Right, so store, store. They're English as well. So I am looking to make an English team at the start or a BPL. Not exactly sure, but I'm gonna start buying um, gold players that are like 400 coins each, just to make sure that I don't spend too much on players. Right, so let's try and make our best team right now. We we'll get all the English players out. Or oh, lagging again. I think the game's trying to show us how to do something, even though we know how to use it. Yep, there we go. Advance. Nationality. England. Boom. Oh, it's just these two. Right, okay, put these two in. So send it back like that. We've got a strike as well. He's got 76 pace. He's not that bad, I guess. Put him in. He'll link with that English guy. Any more? Another English striker. Nice. Put him in. The rest of the team is bobbins. So left back. Left mid. Very nice. Them two link up a tiny bit. Which is, oh, we've got um, strong link as well, which is good. Uh, right back. You don't link with anyone. We'll just put our best plays in the moment. So that's all we can do, really. Centre back. Any right mids? Did we get any right mids and then packs a minute ago? Actually, let's go to any, see who we've got. Is it anyone? Oh, it's England, that's why. Any, there we go. We've got this guy. We'll put him on the bench just in case we need him. Just being as a super sub. That's what I'm going to use for most of the lone players in this series. I'll probably just bring him on as a super sub and try and win like. Well, not win like that, but try and use him to that ability. Because say if I get someone from a random league, he's like pretty fast. I could just put him on um, towards the end of the game, and he should be able to bang a goal in, hopefully. 
So I've got a right mid, so we'll put this guy in a right mid, I guess. He's in the Spanish league. Uh, see, I've got a Spanish right back. Argentinian right back. He's better. I might as well put him in, he's better. So guys, this is team at the moment. It's very bad, I know. We'll improve on it, but this is the reason why it's a road to glory. Start off at the very bottom and work our way up to the very top. Single player, single player seasons. Is that what I want to do? Single player tournament. What's tournaments? Featured 19 hours. La Liga. Blah, blah, blah. One gold gift pack. Should do that. Start off with one gold gift pack. Semi pro. Sylvia Fat Professional, World Class. I guess we should do the Gold, Max Bronze, and you start. Oh, okay. There's no entry requirements for this one, so we'll start off with doing the Starter Cup. Okay. We should be able to win it. If I don't win it, I'll be very disappointed. So I'll just um, advance through this and I'll cut out the boring parts and just leave in the highlights, like maybe a few goals. Maybe if you got attacked or if they um, did a good attack, I put that in. But apart from that, I put everything else out. Also, the next few episodes will be mainly single player, so just hang on until I get a decent team. Then I'll go out and um, play single play online and try and win some online games and maybe do some. Um, what's it called? The well, we're every the weekend the leaving, hoping to hide that, but we can't do that just yet. No point doing it. Teams in right, guys, are back with the highlights. The Pass over to the middle. One, two. This move. Oh, good pass. Put it in. Well, there we go, guys. One nil. Five minutes in. It was amateur, wasn't it? So I should hundred percent win this tournament. If I don't win this tournament, then I'll just quit YouTube. Ridiculous if we don't win. Amateurs is too easy. That's because I've been playing this game for, like, what, seven years, six years plus? More than that. I was playing PSP and DS back in the day. So we should be able to smash this team. I might uh, just pop a few goals in and start passing it around and try and waste some time. So let the ball go out loads because that does make the games last longer. We don't need to live making them last longer. Just try and get in and out and make the games as quick as possible. On the counter attack now. What do you use a sprint button. Should be able to finish this. Put it in top corner. It. There we go. Very easy. Second goal in 11 minutes. Also, should we go for more goals? Don't get more goals. We're going for more points. We're going for more goals. I'm not exactly sure. But if we do that, then I'll just waste all the fitness on the guys. And I definitely don't want to use the fitness because I haven't got a first team yet. So I don't really want to use the second team here on the bench with this Bobbins. This could be a chance. Got to be. That is a fantastic right, three go. Goal. It's just ridiculous, guys. I won't show you um, all the highlights. I'll just show you to the half-time whistle, well, and then I'll be the full-time whistle as well. Goal. Just show how the game's going, but I don't need to show you this. It's boring to watch, to be honest. Well, it's just too easy. I don't need to do this. But this will get us extra gold and that pack as well. And we do get the yeah, like 500 goals, 500 gold for winning the game or playing the game and then that 200 gold extra or was it 500 gold extra from the catalogue so we get a decent amount of coins from the game so each game I'll be able to get Dennis. around about one good gold player each game so that means about 11 games um, until I get a decent team but then I do get other well, rewards from winning the the cup so we have to play less games to get a proper team which is decent so as that's half time, it's six nil. I just started passing around at the back and just moving up slowly, just getting the good passes with ninety one percent pass accuracy. And um, six shots, six on target. It shows it's amateur because the ball's just going in the back of net whenever you shoot. It's dominating as we was expecting. Um I won't show you any more highlights, I'll show you when we get to the end of the game and then show you the coins that we get well, and we if you're buying one. Like the so see you at the end of the game guys. Right guys, that's the end of the game. So we did win 7 0, or scored one goal in the second half. We're just passing around for most of the game. Let's look at the stats. The team did really well, but I expect them to do really well. So I'm just going to go to 6 from 8 to 7. Should we get more than that? Uh, coin boost. We've got 325 from winning the game. Is that. 
I don't even know. There we go, guys. Six from each seven. We should be able to buy a pretty decent play with that. They're the stats, but we don't really need to look at them. Especially not for these games, in a way. But when we get into the proper um, online games, I'll show you the stats. So, guys, I did want to say that my um, videos won't um, get as much progress as the other YouTubers. So, like, say if you're watching the Penthes or Nick28T, they have some really good um, Road to Glories. And they do, like, they get through a lot and they got like 500,000 plus coins. That's like, what, a month and a half, two months of playing it. So, mine's not going to be as moon as fast as that just because I've got a full time job and their job is YouTube. And they've got other videos to make, like Call of Duty. And they've got to edit the videos and make thumbnails for other videos. So, it does take quite a while. And my videos won't get that much progress, but they will. But just not as much as them, so don't expect to get as much progress as them, basically. But we do need... Do we need Striker? Our Striker's decent, aren't they? Let's go and look at our team. What what place we definitely need. There's somewhere where they're not English, basically. And they're not our best players. So could either a right mid... A right mid... English right mid would do. Yeah, we'll go for English right mid. It'll fit in to... Um, them two players, so they're both English. But I definitely want to go to BPL when buying the uh, midfielders because the oops, that striker. When I'm buying the midfielders because I do eventually want to build a BPL team. Every few episodes I will change up the team, but as we're not just yet, more than five hundred gold. Not just yet because uh, we haven't got that enough gold to do that. But when we do, Redmond's yeah, Redmond's pretty good actually. We get this one. First first owner, 550 coins, 50 cheaper than the other one. So that's good. So we'll send him to. Where to send him to? I press RT. Oh. Did that. So send him to the club. So yeah, I definitely want to build a BPL team at the start, but when we get into like, what, 50,000 coins ish, when we get a decent amount of way through, I'll start changing the teams more. I uh, want to make an, enough profit in each team though, I don't want to make a loss in each team. But I will try and make different teams to make the episodes unique. So we'll search, you should pop up straight away, there we go. So guys, I will be doing some bronze pack method as well in the future. Just, it'll help, I've never done it before, so it might make me fail quite a lot. But it'll be like a learning curve to do. And it could be very good for this series, because it helps you get players for squad building challenges and you can sell them. And it is pretty good. Like if you if you're good at it, then you do make quite a lot of coins. Because then um, this year compared to last year with the squad building challenges, the um, bronze pack method is pretty reliable. So we'll go back to single player seasons tournament and quarter final. Once again, it's amateur, so I can basically close my eyes and play the game against KV Ustende. So we'll play this game. Now. I'll show you one or two highlights in the game, but apart from that, I'll just show you the stats at half time and end of the game. I'm not sure how long this video will be because I've never done an episode like this or a series like this ever. So I'm going to record, I don't know how much I'm going to record, I'm just going to record a bit of gameplay. And it might be real long, it might be short, I'm not exactly sure. That would take me a while to get used to how long like certain amount of play time would get me in a video. But I'll find that out um, in time. So guys, I'll bring you back with the highlights. So guys, look, that's 5-0 in 33 minutes. We're definitely going to win this game. Um, I knew we would anyway it's amateur. I'm definitely better than amateur. I can beat... I can beat world class depending on what team I've got. But I can't beat, I can't really beat legendary. I can depending on what team I've got. But then, pff, I would say a really good game. So guys, for this series, I'm looking to upload one about every three days -ish. I'm not exactly sure. Maybe two days, depending if I've got a lot of free time. Just because this video takes about a while to um, record. It takes about an hour and a half to record. But sometimes it takes longer because, like, say, trading. Trading takes longer than that. Trading can take a few hours. We just do it show. It's like, I do know the trading main account. And um, the bronze pack method, that takes quite a while. And then I'll put them into squad builders and then get free gold plays out of all that. So that would take quite a while. I don't mind to smash that over the crossbar. But yeah, one every three days round about. Because overall, editing and thumbnail and everything will take quite a while to do. Right guys, there we go. That's half time. We're dominating this game. 
So like I said before, the first few episodes will be mainly games, um, just to get the coins, because I need the coins to make the better teams, and also, um, I can't really do any buying and selling or bonus pack methods, because I don't have the leftover coins to be able to do that, so to be able to do that, I need to make sure I get a decent team, oh my god, why is it run for everyone? Please don't score, I think I'm actually, please. Terrific stop. I, wasn't, I wasn't concentrating, so there we go, but... Yeah, um, I don't have enough coins to do any um, buying. I'll be able to do a bit of buying selling, but not loads to make quite a lot of money. So that will be coming more down the line, and so the bronze pack method. Because um, they're like 400 coins a pack, and I don't even this have 400 coins to buy play yet. So, listen, counter attack. No, this should be go. Oh, it's a choke. Pro. But yeah, guys, just don't expect anything much apart from gameplay in the next year, first few episodes. I'll do some squad builders as well. And the ones that we can do anyway, but the bronze pack method in the future will help us do more squad builders. So at the start, the series will be slow, but once we get oh, more nice coins, a better team, the done. series will pick up and definitely become a lot better. If you guys do like this, these are kind of episodes totally and the series, please really like and subscribe if you have already. So we'll skip to the end of the game. So, guys, that's the end of the game. We won 8 0, I'm pretty sure it was. Yeah. So that was quarter final, so into the semi final next game. With some danger. Yeah, let's check the stats. Woodrow got the man of match as well. Redmond seemed pretty good, but he's amateur, so I can't really tell. 724, so that's a lot of coins, so that's good. Um, 16 12, 91% pass accuracy, 57% possession, so expected me to do that. Uh, I probably I want to get a decent team after maybe this after finishing this cup probably to start doing the online not the no the single player seasons maybe I'll start doing this probably probably pick that one it's got the most you get the most coins yeah the ultimate league so I probably pick when I do that one but we have got eight hundred sixty one guild. So I can buy two players, 400 each, two gold players. So what do we need to improve on? English centre-back and right-back. Okay. The reason why I'm doing this side first because these two have a link, so they're not too bad. I'll definitely get a better centre-mid. But, uh, let's, yeah, let's get a better centre-mid. So English centre-mid and a English centre-back. We'll go with the centre back first. I'm not sure if we have to get a player for 400 coins though. Not 400. Yeah, no, they go for about 500, don't they? Ah. Preferably English, and then centre mid. Can we get on 400 and 400? No, we can't, can we? Yeah, so I guess we can only buy one player. So Ghana, Britain. Huddleston, Rodwell, Cleverly. So these are the really cheap ones. Ward Prowse. I'm looking for a tallish guy. I know Huddleston is pretty tall. Yeah, 6'2, he's decent. Rodwell. Isn't that bad? To be honest, I might go with Cleverly. He's 450 coins as well. Did you pick him up? I did pick him up. That's fine. 450 coins. He's cheap and. Most people here, yeah, they're all 500. Shame I can't, I haven't got enough coins to get another player. I've got 411. Oh, Cleverly's 400 there. Noble Delph. That's a shame. That's fine, though. 450 coins. I think that's a pretty good deal. Ah, oh, it's 400 there. Eh, wasted 50 coins. That's quite annoying. We could have bought another player. It's fine, though. We'll make a few. One deal. We'll make a few mistakes in the series, but that's fine. So we'll go ahead and put him in the team right now. Clever's not too bad. He's got alright passing, I'm pretty sure. Let's check his stats anyway. Rodwell seems pretty good, as I said before. Let's look at Rodwell's stats. We didn't really look at him properly. So 86 pace, really good. 79 dribbling, that's really good. 68 shot and, pa and 69 pass. It's decent, not the best, but it's definitely decent. What foot is he? He is right for ah. So when he cuts, it's okay though because this year, and uh, driven along the, driven on, driven on the floor across the goal, goals, um, shots or whatever, 
they had that really overpower this year. So him coming from the right and driven it, driving it from to the left side of the goal, which is which would be good because they are overpowered at the moment. We'll take this guy out and put him on the bench for a super sub or something like that maybe. And we'll swap this one. We're searching centre mid cleverly. Let's look at cleverly. So at seventy pace, which is decent. We don't really need someone who's um, amazing pace in centre mid. Seventy eight dribbling. Yeah, it's pretty good. As I was expecting low than that to be honest. And 77 pass, which is good. 69 shot and physical, not 64 physical. It's all right. We definitely won't be expecting to bang a few goals, but this is my starting team, so we can't expect to, too much from it. But we will eventually um, get better players for each position, but that will take quite a while. So it's the next day, and I forgot to end the video yesterday, so thanks for watching, guys. Please hit the like and subscribe button if you haven't already. Go look at my other videos as well. Hopefully you enjoyed them. Just got some squad builders. I'll do some Call of Duty, Infinite Warfare, and COD 4 Remasters. You guys might like that. Make sure to hit that like button, though, and show me support on this series, because I don't know if I was going to do this or not. So please show that you did enjoy the episode by doing that. Thanks for watching, and peace.